With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So the question is, a block placed on a rough horizontal surface is pushed with the force F acting horizontally on the block. The magnitude of F is increased and acceleration produced is plotted in the graph below. So basically this is the graph between the force and the acceleration. Okay. And there are some options and we have to tell that which option is correct and which is not. Now when you see this graph, you can see that from zero, suppose this value is zero. Okay. From 0 to 10, there is no acceleration, okay? From 0 to 10, as you can see in this graph, there is no acceleration. Acceleration is 0 and acceleration is 0. No acceleration means acceleration is 0. And acceleration is 0, that simply means that body doesn't move. Body doesn't move. And body is not moving. That means friction force is present. Okay, body doesn't move. That means friction force is present there and the maximum value of friction force is 10 Newton because after that, after 10, we have get the value of acceleration. That means now this friction force does not overcome the force and body starts moving. That means the maximum value of maximum frictional force is 10 Newton. Okay, now in the first option, they are saying that mass of the block is 2 kilogram. Now, if we apply, as you can see, at 30, when the force is 30 Newton, at that time, acceleration is 10. Okay, as you can see in this graph, when force is 30 Newton, at that time, acceleration is given as 10 meter per second square. Okay, and at this time, frictional force, maximum frictional force is present there, and that frictional force maximum is 10 Newton. So if I write the force equation, then I can write 30 Newton minus this friction force that is equals to MA. This is the force equation. Okay, net force equals to MA and net force is the uh, maximum force that is 30 Newton on the body and friction force is also present that is 10 Newton. So that means 30 minus 10 equals to MA. So from here, the value of M is coming out to be 10 minus 10 is 20 and A is 10. That is equals to 2 kilogram. So the mass of this body is 2 kilogram. Now we know that maximum frictional force F maximum frictional force is given by mu mg. Okay, and maximum friction force is 10 Newton that is equals to mu and the value of m is 2 kilogram and g is 10. So from here the value of mu is coming out to be half that means 0.5. So now we have the frictional constant that is 0.5 mu and have the mass of body that is 2 kilogram. So let's check the option. First option is mass of the block is 2 kilograms. So this is the correct option. Second option is coefficient of friction between block and surface is 0.5. So this is also the correct option. Now, third option is limiting friction between block and surface is 10 Newton. Limiting friction is basically the maximum friction when body is doesn't move. Okay. And after that, when the value of forces increase at that time, friction doesn't overcome the force and body start moving. So basically limiting friction is basically the maximum friction, which is 10 Newton. So this is also the correct option. Now the last option is when force is 8 Newton, friction between block and surface is 10 Newton. As you can see that maximum friction is 10 Newton. When force applied on the body is 8 Newton at that time you can see that frictional force is greater than the force applied on the body that means this time force uh, friction force requires on the body is only 8 Newton so that means the value of friction force is 8 Newton not the 10 Newton so this is not the correct option okay because friction force required for the body to re re stop this force is only 8 Newton the body required only 8 Newton friction force to stop the body okay so required friction force is only 8 Newton not the 10 Newton okay so we have three correct option that is first second and third and fourth option is not correct okay thank you for class 6 to 12 ITG and NEET level Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.